Hey, I'm Jamie. And I'm Blake. And together we are... Blame me. Blame me. Yeah. Uh, today we're doing something fun that Jamie has no idea what we're doing. I have, like, guesses, because that's what, what you what, made me do. What are your guesses? <laughs> what I made you do. <laughs> Anyways, uh, guesses? My guess is it's some sort of, like, a bracket. A bracket? Oh, almost. Okay. Kind of. He just kind told of. me to go to my bookshelves and grab my 12 favorite books. Yes. Right, so we have our 12 favorite books that are on our bookshelves. Um, so what we're doing is in our neighborhood, and I think across the United States, there's these things called birdhouse libraries, mm -hmm. right? And so basically the idea is you leave a book and you get to take a book, right? And so our books normally go through the cycle where we have our favorite books and they stay, and ones that aren't great end up in birdhouse libraries, and other ones get loaned out, right? So what we're going to do is we're breaking these books into groups of three. And one of them you have to birdhouse library, one of them you have to loan away, and one of them is for keeps. And so what I want loan, to do is like, make that. to a friend. Yes, three. which may not ever come back. That's just how loaning books works. Okay. Right? So not there's kind of the, the degrees of risk okay. um, in here. Right? So we're going to start with these first three here. Oh, this is so rude. All right. So uh, we have the, this way is better? I don't know, the Book Thief, uh, the Nightingale, and the Midnight Library. Right, is our is our three that we're dealing with here. Okay, so which one is first? Let's start with the one you're absolutely you're absolutely keeping, staying on your your uh, shelf. Well, one of them arrived yesterday in the mail. Okay, great. I think I got to keep that one, so it's at least staying on. My How shelf. did you pick one that's your favorite and you haven't read it? I read it. I just don't own it. Oh, I'm excited to oh. own it. Great. So, so the nightingale. The nightingale stays on the shelf. Stay. Great. Okay. Which one? Is going to get loaned. Which one's going to the birdhouse? Well, we already did a video on what is the book I recommend to people, and that would be the book thief. So that's being loaned. All right. So we're birdhousing the midnight I library. I don't like this. <laughs> I know you don't. So, so tell us. Tell us why. Why? Why did this get loaned as opposed to this one? I've loaned both of them out. Sure. Yeah. Um, but why would you loan this as opposed to this? The book thief is just life changing and it needs to change more lives. Okay. Why then are you not keeping this on your shelf and you're you're getting rid of it? Are you keeping this on your shelf and you're loaning this out? Um yeah. I think I'm fine with that actually. Does that mean this one you you like it but you don't want other people to read it? Maybe. I don't know if people would love this as much as they would love the book. Okay, so it's not necessarily you're keeping it because you just need it. Interesting. Right. You're uh Yeah. So, so although here's the thing. I might need, I'm of need now. This isn't the one I need. So this is the one that's staying on our Or show. maybe the Midnight Library. The There's, Midnight Library listen, is the one you need? Listen, there is one paragraph in that book that like. So listen, just, listen. Uh, of these three books, if you're putting one in a birdhouse, which one is it going to be? Mm, I don't think I'm good at this game. <laughs> birdhouse, like I'm never going to have it again. Yeah. Ew. Okay, I'm sticking with my original. Okay, so so the nightingale stays on the shelf. The book feed gets loaned out, maybe never to return. And the midnight library is gone, never to return. I don't like this game at all. All right, okay. I don't Good think enough. I signed up for this. I, uh, I know you didn't. It's excellent. Ooh, this one's going to be easier. Oh, okay. All right. So the three we have here are uh, Ready Player One, Divergent, and Hunger Games. Um, okay, let's let's see. First, which one is the one that stays on your shelf? Hunger Games. Hunger Games is the one that stays on your shelf. Mm -hmm. Okay, you've made a horrible error. Which one of these is the one that you uh, are going to loan out? Ready Player One. That makes more sense. And then uh, Divergent, where you will... See ya. Yep. That's if it fine. ended better, maybe I'd be sadder. Right. Right. I'm so, not sad about that one. Wait a minute. What? You're saying this is a better book than this one? Just saying I... This is like more of a classic, and you kind of need a copy in your house. Uh, this is like a gem that I need to share with everyone. I mean, I mean, and if I get it back, all the better. Uh, I mean, I full know. disclosure: this may be my favorite book of all time. So I'm, I'm you know. struggling with this a little bit, but okay, I guess I guess that's what happens. So we have you can't just uh, not own Hunger Games. Hunger Games is, all, is shelved. Ready Player One is loaned out. Diversion was. Birdhouse. That was really easy. Thanks for putting Divergent in there. You're welcome. I mean, I guess I put Divergent Yes. In there. All right. Next. Ooh. This is going to be a good one. We have Cinder. It's such a cute book. All right. A Court of Mists and Fury. It's the second one. And The Throne of Glass. And I said The Throne of Glass. It's just Throne of Glass. Okay. Now, which one of these three 
excellent books are you going to be, uh, I don't know, uh, first let's start Birdhouse. Which one's going to the Birdhouse? This is a tough one for you, isn't it? I don't like it. I think... Next. <laughs> no, come on. Birdhouse one. Um, Birdhouse one. The one that's Birdhouse like, House I'm never going to have it back. Yes, never going to have it back. I like all of these. I know you do. Okay, Wait. okay. Which one? If you'd only have one of these three, yeah. which one would you take? Let's start with that. Which one's being shelved? I think Throne of Glass. Throne of Glass? Wow. Is it is it because of the the pale woman on the front? No. Oh. Just because that one... That's like what rekindled my love of reading. Oh. It has like that spot, you know? Yeah. Plus it's, yeah. Hell women. All right. Uh, okay, what about, uh, what, which one of these uh, is going to be loaned out? I think loaning out Cinder because I can't loan this out to just anybody. Oh, oh <laughs> I see how this book is. Ah, I might need to read this. I but think. I have loaned it out to people. There's just some people that I would never give it to. Okay. All right. But Cinder would go to everybody. Yeah. So this is, Although, this is, this gonna, is like This juvenile. is going to be put in a birdhouse where any random person should pick it up. <laughs> put it there. Fair this one is like juvenile and like predictable, but it's so cute. Yep. And like it ends well. It's just a fun, easy series. Okay. All right. The next three, which I'm excited for here. Nice. All right. So we have Harry Potter and the Half-Blood Prince. Good book. Mistborn, which you can tell is well loved here in this household, and uh, the Great Hunt. Oh, I thought I grabbed Eye of the World. I think Eye of the World is literally loaned out at the moment. It is. Yeah. So basically, the Wheel of Time here. Okay. So which of these? Wait. So is this Wheel of Time and Harry Potter, or is it that? Uh, one? These three. I assume you picked your favorite in the series. Of each oh, of these. I thought. I mean, like this. Okay. Well, just consider it the Eye of the World. You know what? The Great Hunt's a really good one. Yeah, I actually think the Great Hunt is better than the other. I world. think so too. I okay. actually think they get not better so as they go along, up until like book seven or eight. Mm -hmm. So I'm still on five, so they're still. Yeah, great. she's almost to the best part of five. It's gonna be excellent. Anyways, okay, so which one oh. is the one staying on your shelf? No, that was too fast. Wow, that was too fast. I think Harry Potter. <laughs> okay, so Harry Potter staying on your shelf. Uh, which one of these two are you loaning out to a friend? This one and Mistborn is the one that's birdhouse. I'm sorry, Brent could you Sanderson. imagine going to a birdhouse I, and finding Mistborn? I mean, it would be pretty amazing, especially this version because I probably want like the new white version that looks beautiful. That would be pretty awesome. Um, they are pretty awesome. Um, but yeah, that wasn't as hard as I thought it would be. Wow, Mistborn was the easiest. All right, well, yes. here you go. This was uh, I don't know what you'd call it shelf loan birdhouse. Uh, for Jamie's 15 favorite, 12, 12 favorite 12, books? Yeah. 12 favorite books in our house. Uh, let us know what you would birdhouse in your house right now. Um, and also maybe look up and see if there's birdhouse libraries around. Uh, are they actually called birdhouse libraries? That's what my kids named them. <laughs> what are they called? They're something. Uh, They're like little neighborhood libraries. Yeah. Little They're, uh, they look like a birdhouse. I don't know what to tell you. Birdhouse is. Yeah, I don't. Birdhouse library. Go find your own. Like and subscribe. <laughs>